That's the cream of the crop. Oh, yeah. I'm Macho Man, Randy Savage. Macho Man's coming to get you. How you doing, my guy? I'm doing good. Doing, I'm, I'm almost over my, my death, so, you know. Your death? Almost almost over it. The plague? It's the sickness? Great. The, the sick, I am down with the sickness. Is that, that wow. the thing that Disturb was talking about? I think so. I think they were t- talking about a stomach bug, just, and I get it now. Just a stomach bug the whole time. Yeah, I'm gonna go get my chin pierced, so because I, I understand them now. And get like a really small goatee, but like, just, yeah, right there. I'm a, like this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. What are you doing? There we go. I'm giving myself a goatee. Yeah, <laughs> but you kind of already have. No, you have to have it wrap around. Yeah, like that. That's the goatee. There you go. Now you look like you're you're a, a faith minister, like a young pastor. I don't have the leather bracelet on. <laughs> <laughs> or the frosted tips. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, so it's um, what was it episode thirty-eight? Uh, yeah. Yeah. This is uh, this is coming off of our one year. One year birthday, yeah. Three point one four. We managed to put it on Pi Day. Did we really? Yeah. Oh, that's I mean, that was, cool. That was our first, very first podcast that we did. You know what the only pie is that matters? Uh, pizza. Mhm. I think Strombo is probably up there too. Strombo. Yeah, Stromboli. Uh, yeah, you know, it's you're basically right. You're right. That, that is more of a pie than pizza is. Now that I think about it. Yeah. All right, new answer, Sean Bowley. Only pie that matters. Only pie that matters. Pie lives matter. Oof. Pie in the sky. Yeah. Pie in the sky? High in the sky, pie in the sky. Draw it up here. Pie in the sky. Maybe I'll do that uh, with the After Effect. Yeah. So what have you been playing this week? <laughs> um, I've been playing uh, a lot of everybody's golf. I, uh... I bought probably farther than I got, by the way. No, probably not. Um, I didn't play it that long. I bought um, 100 foot robot golf. In VR? Yeah. Yeah. Nice. So I've been playing a little bit of that too. Um, and I've been... sounds like you're just getting into golf. Like next time you're gonna be like, I, I bought Rory McIlroy PGA 2019. No, no, no. It, I, I got it because of how ridiculous it looks and that it had a VR feature. That's how it starts, man. <laughs> next next podcast, you're gonna pull it, come out with a hat on with a little cotton ball on the top, the checkered shirt. That's this golf monkeys. What's up? What's up? I fucking love golf. I like to drive around a golf cart and drink PBR. <laughs> <laughs> No, um, but I also played a lot of Beat Saber lately, and I've been getting a little bit better and better at it. Nice. I think I'm getting. I'm. A... What? Sorry. What are you doing? Okay, go pull my mic out. Okay. Your Kit Kat. Yeah. Um. Oh. I've been getting like, I think I'm doing like hard and like, low tier expert songs now. So. Nice, I've been wor- working on that a lot. Uh, so let me let me see the Macho Man shirt though. Look look back. Let me let me see it. Oh yeah, coming to get you. Ten dollars at your local Meyer. Ten dollars. Am I looking the right way to look at you? By the way. Yeah, you should be looking at me like that. Yeah, that, that's good. Okay. <laughs> um. <laughs> I just completely forgot what I was gonna say now. Yeah, was, you've been doing low tier and expert on Beat Saber. Oh, um, I was gonna say, hey, uh, that that flu is uh, really working out for you, man. 
getting the flu. Yeah, man, you, you're losing some weight, man. It's because I can't eat. It's awful. <laughs> Just all I've eaten is chicken and chicken accessories, and I'm sick of it. <laughs> chicken and chicken accessories. <laughs> That's what I call chicken broth, man. <laughs> and you've been peeing out your butt. A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> you're looking good. Thanks, you're losing man. Losing some weight, man. Yeah, yeah, you know, I I can't tell if it's that or that I've been walking around more at work, but whatever. Hey, it works. <laughs> I I do I do miss pizza though. I tell you, <laughs> body by Nate. Eat a pizza body. every week and then and then poop out of your butt with pee. Yeah, pee out your asshole. Yes. Yeah. Little chunks just. <laughs> so uh, it sounds it sounds like this. <laughs> That's my poop. Oh no. <laughs> so <laughs> what have you been playing? Um. So last night was actually the first time I've been able to play anything in about a week because it's it has been giving me motion sickness. Um, but I played a couple of rounds of Rocket League. Uh, that went okay, and then I started playing Devil May Cry Five this morning. Really? And that is, yeah, it is the most Japanese ass game I've ever played. And I mean, it's you good. did play uh, Monster Hunter, but not for long. Yeah. It's basically uh, Japanese just... ass game that I enjoy. How about that? <laughs> but uh, it's... you've never played any of the other ones, so you just nope. decided was... to jump right into five. Yeah. Why not? I was just. I just... was like, it looks, it looks interesting, and I, everything I've heard is look, it's good. And it's so far it's the perfect amount of linear because I everything I've been playing had been like open world and this is just like no you go this way and you do some shit you fight some people and you go this way yeah do some shit fight some people the uh, <clears throat> you can tell it's a Capcom game uh, almost immediately when somebody opens their mouth because the voiceover is shit oh, always yeah. there's one girl that has the worst southern accent I've ever oh, heard no, yeah I know. It's I, like it was awful, and it, it I'm just like Ugh, every time. That was uh. Remember when we were doing the E3 kind of watch? And yeah. Like, uh, yeah. That, that that girl. Yeah, I don't know. And it's like, and, and you know, it's it's Japanese because it's like over sexualized. Like she'll bend, like she's like the person that crafts everything for you. Yeah. So if you buy um. You start off playing as Nero, and he's got what they call devil triggers because his arm's just gone. Yeah. And she creates new ones. When she reaches under the table to grab it, it just zooms in on her tramp stamp. And I'm just like, oh, I feel dirty. <laughs> I mean, that's, but I like it. That's Japanese games for you, though. I know. Over the top but I, acting an... and over sexualized. And... Yeah, but I was like, it, it is a gorgeous ass game though. It's the same engine as the Resident Evil Two remake, and like, Resident Evil Two looked really good. I didn't play it, but it, like, it's that amount of quality, but just everything is just cranked to eleven in terms of like speed and everything too. So it looks good and it's fast as fuck. Yeah, uh, I take it you never played DMC. No, I did not. The the reboot of it. Not a single one. The. Well, okay, so the DMC one, uh, the that's reboot, the one that everybody got mad about. Yeah, it's actually black hair. it's actually pretty good, and um, it's actually more Americanized. It's more like American acting and not over the top. Yeah, but I I don't know. It's the right amount of over over the top. Like it's not taking itself seriously, and it knows what it is. So I I don't I'm enjoying it so far. Well, that's good. I'm only like four missions into it. So tonight I'm gonna play more of that, and then I'm gonna play some Trials Rising. Are you I love uh Trials? <laughs> are you playing all that on PlayStation, or are you playing on PC? PlayStation. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I've been wanting to, you know, just sit in that there lazy boy and just play some video games. I need to rearrange this room though, because that window over there, no matter if I have it all the way closed, still glares on the TV. So I need to do some moving around because I'm sick of it. You also got random Asian Barack Obama over hey, there man. still. <laughs> we can do it. Hope. <laughs> change. We... <laughs> Chang or change? Change. <laughs> Chang. 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 Real Chang. Real change. 
2020. Uh-huh. Yeah, when you put that on the doc, I was very surprised because I didn't, I didn't picture you a Devil May Cry person. And I, and I'm not, but I don't know. I've been wanting to play something like I have Bioshock. I played that for a minute. Um, I need to get back to it, but I, don't know, I just wanted something where like, you just get pushed and you just, you, there's no diverting, and I'm enjoying it. Yeah, I'm it's stylish as fuck. When uh, DMC came out, I I enjoyed it. And I and I enjoyed the boss fights that they got in there, and uh, I don't know. I'm very, very like uh, recognizable boss fight. Uh, yeah. And en- en- enthusiast, like, like uh, they they got like a crazy boss fight. I'm just uh, that much more into that game. You know what I mean? What's the second boss fight in Dark Souls? Is it Taurus Demon, like the big guy on like top of the castle wall? I think that's the first that's the first well, fight the first boss that, fight. so oh, yeah. the first boss fight in devil may care devil cry. may cry why wow um i think that's uh, what they use, they were gonna call it um it's like the taurus demon if the taurus demon had a giant stomach and uh, a giant mouth in its stomach oh nice i was like oh that's gross but cool and that that japanese synth metal going on whew. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's yeah. my impression. Da 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 da. Sounds, <laughs> why does your every accent you try to do sound Irish? You know, that's all I got. <laughs> I'm not even Irish. Ja, man. <laughs> Slappy de bees. Why flying here? Cat package here. It's awful. <laughs> um, and then tonight, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna play. <laughs> Play some Trials. I'm excited to play Trials again. I haven't played it in a couple of years. Did you play I, Trials? I played it back when it was on the Xbox 360. Oh, man. I remember those were old ones. Something about that game. I just like I just sit there and it's like, oh, oh, and then I crash and I die. But you know, I'm like, excited. Like the 3D, but like from the side. Yeah, the, it's all physics obstacles. based. It's, it's like watching Rick and Morty. It makes me feel smart when I'm good at it. Smart when you're good at it. Mm-hmm. So, but, so that's all I've been playing. It's pretty good, pretty good. Uh, can you ask uh, Asian Barack Obama behind you what he's been playing? Barack, what have you been playing? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, Stardew Valley? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Anamusha? All right. All right. Cool. Oh, man. Cool. I would not mind an uh, Amanusha game or a, a, a Amanusha. I don't know. I've never played one. <laughs> uh, just like it's a Japanese name that I know. Oh, what's that? Persona Persona Five. Okay, you got no. All right, country's going to shit, but you know you just <laughs> country's oh, going playing to some JRPG. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> I think you might have went a little too far with that, but I, I still enjoy it. <laughs> hey man, gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> and uh, the, the shitty part was, is when you were doing all that, you were like cutting yeah. in and out too. Uh, so it was, it was uh, doing like the robot voice. <clears throat> I think that's better actually. <laughs> it was pretty good. So, um, Nintendo, Nintendo. Uh, announced their new uh, Pokemon starters. Mm-hmm. And uh, it was it was Grokey, Score Bunny, and Sobble. So, uh, which one were you planning on going with again? Squabble. Sobble. 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 Scrabble. Sobble. Scrabble. You, By the way, are you gonna buy a Switch when this comes out? Just to play it. Um, I'm I'm gonna probably buy a Switch pretty soon because I get my bonus next week. So nice. I might save up and get a. Get a laptop and then maybe, maybe a switch. Don't uh, don't lick the cartridges. Yeah, no, I uh, I know that. I've I've gotten two people to do it. And it's fucking great every time. I've done it once actually. It Have is, you? Yeah, it was that time <coughs> the New Year's party. Remember? Oh, that's right. But like uh, last time I went to my brother's, I finally found my Mario Kart uh cartridge there. Oh shit! He's like, why was it downstairs? And I was like, oh, it's because I had Shelby lick it. And he goes, what do you mean? I was like, just do it. I do it. He goes, oh fuck. <laughs> I, I wonder, like, what did they do to do that exactly? 
I I don't know. They they're like they gave the cartridges to some guy that had the flu, uh, and made him just like kind of kind of puke on it once. And then they sanitized it, but it still had the puke taste. <laughs> so there's just some guy on a factory line who's going, huh? Huh? he gets paid to be sick. He gets paid to be sick, man. That's pretty dope. It's like uh. What was that episode of Futurama with the slurp where they find out that the slurp comes from the butthole? The slurp. I mean, there's so many things wrong with what you said, but... <laughs> Is there? It's like Is it not it's slurm, sl- and it's like... Slurm. It's that soda, and it comes from, like, this alien's... Uh, yeah, pretty much. Is it, not, Is it not their butthole? It's not their butthole. Look, it's more like a... Look like, it looks like a butthole to me. <laughs> well, it's like an udder, but for, like, that alien. Uh. Okay. And it was fucked so up at the end of it when uh, when she's sucking on her own. Mm-hmm. Everybody's tried to do it. <laughs> Many of us have uh, succeeded. Looking at you, Marilyn Manson. I don't think it was Marilyn Manson. I'm pretty sure that the, the story is the guy from Tool did that. that oh, really? Yeah. Marilyn well, Manson maybe. never really took out two ribs. Okay. But the guy from uh, Tool's been on enough acid that he tried it. Uh, but what Pokemon starter are you going to be? Take it back. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm probably going to go with Grokey. Grokey. I want him to turn to like a giant uh, gorilla that carries trees or something. Or a gorilla that has trees for arms. Yeah, that'd be kind of sweet too. Just like wood arms. I mean, that would suck yeah. if you had to fight any fire Pokemon, but... He's basically going to be, like, if Groot and Ape Man had a baby. Yes. Yeah, I'd Great be down bait. with that. Great bit. <clears throat> uh... which, which, uh, which one are you going to get, though? Sword or shield? I don't know the differences yet. Neither do I. I mean, when, when they did Sun and Moon... Uh... They they alternated, like, times. So when it was day on one, it was night on the other. Yeah. And then you got different Pokemon in some of them. Pokemons. But they haven't really uh, they haven't really announced what they're going to have in the other one. They just yeah. announced the starters. So, I don't know. I got to see a little bit more. Indubitably. Indubitably. I warned you. What? Oh. Yeah. Oops. I don't know. I'm just more so you know. What? Uh, more that you don't come in here with nothing on is what I was saying. Oh. <laughs> what? The podcast. Oh. I'm still sick. Hi, Shelby. Hi, Shelby. Am I going to your grandparents? Okay, what time are you going? Okay, I will try. I didn't know that. My bad. Um, on on the bright side, I have it edited so that the door is not there. So, good call. So, uh, it only sees your head. So, I would have seen it, but no one else would have. That's good enough. <laughs> so, uh, I I heard that you got to kind of wrap it up, right? So, apparently. Okay, so nerd curious, yeah, whatever. Nerd curious. Nerd Curious. Today's Nerd Curious Nerd term curious. is uh, AAA, which basically means a very high budget video game. From uh, I thought it was budget. always attempting anal. Anal. I mean. Always attempt anal. <laughs> was it? Uh, ABC always becoming. Anal, anal, anal. <laughs> the all anal trilogy. Yes. <laughs> hey, make make him What's... smack her ass. What the fuck, man? <laughs> the fucking it's too much. <laughs> you and your little dog. <laughs> that was a great movie. I don't care what people say. Very underrated Kevin Smith movie, I tell you. I mean, his his movies <clears throat> really gone gone downhill lately. But uh, hey, man, hopefully hey. the Jay and Silent Bob reboot is good. Yeah. That's all I got. We'll we'll see. As long as uh, yeah, yeah they make money off of that. Anyway. Triple A, basically like the very high end uh, 
high budget video games from the bigger companies like your EAs, your Ubisofts, uh, yeah. your Activisions, Playstations and Sonys, yeah. Nintendo's Bethesda. Naughty Dog. Oh, no, Bethesda's part of it. Naughty Dog. Naughty Dog can pretty much do anything they want to now. Mm-hmm. They can. Would they you don't say... have to make another Uncharted game. They don't. Do you think Naughty Dog and Insomniac are on the same tier? No. No? No. Um... It? I like I really like Insomniac games, but I don't think they've had the quality of storytelling down yet. Yeah. Okay. Whereas Uncharted and The Last of Us are like very good stories. Spider Man was a good story, but predictable. That's that's my only thing. Yeah. Any uh any triple A's that you really enjoy? God of War. Great. Yeah. Great, great game. God of War, uh, yeah. The the PS four one. Yeah, yeah. We don't talk about the original one. No? No. No. We only go back there if you want to play the mini game. The mi- <laughs> you know. Circle. You know what I'm talking about. Circle, R- circle. R- Spin the stick. Spin the stick. Um. Uh, I don't say. Oh, Red Dead. I mean, that was a Red good was one recently. Good. Uh, Capcom. Uh, do you think Capcom's double A or triple A? Um. Triple A, mainly okay. because of Resident Evil. I think that's Resident the most known. Evil. Most known, and then Resident Evil Two Remake did really good. Yeah, they've been having a good year. Yeah, good I past hope... couple years actually. Yeah, I hope they do a Resident Evil Three Remake so I can play that. Remake Resident Evil Four so I can finally play that. I mean, you could play that now on your PS. But I want a remade one, a good quality, like. I want to see Leon's asshole the whole time. You're going to be too scared to play it. No, I won't. I'll do it. It's action. It's action and enough it's, I can do that no, one. No, it's too... I mean, it, that's going to be way too scary for you. No, I'm going to be a big boy. I got over my fear of heights in New Orleans. I'm going to get over my fear of scaries. Fear of scary. <laughs> Your fear of fear? My fear of you, fear. I don't know why you didn't I'm start just, <laughs> just exclusively wearing no fear shirts. I no tell you. That's all, that's all I'm going to wear. No fear, and, and then I'm going to get a dare tattoo. I'm and... going to disassociate myself with you. <laughs> this is what breaks the podcast right yeah. here. Nate, Nate becoming a less a less fearful person, but being a, a douche yeah. at the same <laughs> yeah. time. You're going you're gonna to get frosted tips and have a wallet chain and get affliction shirts and acid yeah, wash, wrong? bedazzled jeans. This all sounds great, man. <laughs> I'm going to become a really big Dane Cook fan, too. <laughs> Love the super finger. <laughs> super finger. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> so uh Nerd anyway. Curious. Nerd Curious, yes. Uh trying to speed things up so we can get you out of here. Uh end game trailer. What did you I, think? I, I enjoyed it. Um I like that it, it mostly didn't give anything away. Like they don't um, except... they don't show anyone that they're fighting, which is interesting. Yeah. Uh, they kind of gave away the fact that Tony makes it back, though, and it kind of bummed me out. Yeah, but, I mean, you kind of knew that was going to happen? Yeah, I know, but they kinda knew I thought, the... but when they were, like, all suiting up at the end, I was like, oh, they're going to go out to space to get Tony. No, he's he's already there. And there's a, also a possibility that, uh, he doesn't. It's fake. Yeah, because they've done that before. Yeah. Well, there was the Infinity War, they showed Hulk and Wakanda, and he's yeah. not there. Yeah, so they, that could be all faked. Could be. Um, I don't know. I'm I'm looking forward to it. Uh, I liked the the whole black and white with only the red yeah. for the first part of the trailer. That was cool. Um, what the fuck's up with Hawkeye's haircut, though? Like uh, Ronan. Yeah, he's not the, Hawkeye uh, in that one. He's Ronan. I know, but the the meme I saw is when you're getting your haircut and Thanos snaps and your barber goes away. <laughs> And I was like, yeah, it looks really bad. Whoever told him that was a good idea was, no, no, not a good haircut He's supposed for you, to be, man. I think that, that's supposed to show him unhinged. I think that's yeah. what, it's supposed to be like a, like a nod that he is unhinged, because that's what Ronan is supposed to be, just like the unhinged version of Hawkeye. So maybe they're like, what are we going to do? Let's just cut my hair really fucking weird. 
Uh, okay. Like it, is his whole family gonna be gone, and he's basically just gonna be the movie? He's gonna be Hawkeye playing Daredevil. Yeah. Or not Daredevil, Punisher is what I meant. Yeah, pretty much. Just the brooding version of him. Just like, oh, I'm so sad. Sad bow and arrow, not got knife that I drag across my arm to clean off because I'm so cool. Yeah. My name's still Clint, though. Mm. <laughs> What did you think of the trailer, though? I thought it was pretty good. I, I did enjoy the, the footage of Raccoon riding on Iron Man with a gun. Iron Patriot, you mean? No, it was Iron Man. Mm -hmm. Looked like Iron Patriot to me. Well, it was... Well, I don't know. I'll have to go back and look, but it, I'm pretty sure it was Iron Man. Because I, I thought I would uh, saw Tony Stark's face, and then they put he puts the helmet on, and then Rocket, like... Reloads his gun and gets ready. Tony Stank. Tony Stank? The man, the myth, the legend. Yes, sir. Son of John Stark. No. not We're not going to start that yet. Yes, we are. No. Yes. Because there was also a Game of Thrones trailer and we haven't talked about it. Thrones of Monkey. Thrones of Monkeys? Yeah. Throne Monkeys? Throne Monkeys. Game of Thrones, Game of Thrones, Game of Thrones. Isn't that next month? Game of Thrones. Yeah, man, it's uh literally about a month away. I've uh I've and actually he... not been trying. I've been trying to stay away from it as much as possible. Like not yeah. watching the trailers of both of these as much, like Game of Thrones and Endgame, because I don't want to, you know. I don't want. I want to go into it like fresh eyed. No, I gotcha. Um, but I did see a little bit yeah. of the Game of Thrones one. It looks good. Yeah. Oh, so I have a quick question for you, because uh, I've made this point to somebody else, and they disagreed with me. They disagreed which with you? Think it, yeah, which do you think is sadder? Um, the spoilers for both Sons of Anarchy and Game of Thrones. Okay. Opie? Or Hodor? That's a hard one, man. They both sacrificed themselves. See, that's my thing, though. I don't think Hodor actually did sacrifice himself. He was basically mind-controlled into doing it. That's, yeah. yeah. So my thing is, Opie is sadder. I feel like... I feel like Opie is sadder, mainly because he actually died when Hodor probably got turned to a zombie. That's true. Because, you know, at the end of the Game of Thrones, uh, Bran is going to turn all the White Walkers back into the regular human beings. You think so? Magic. No. No fucking way. <laughs> Everyone's dying. Yep. Uh, moving on. So, uh, you moving heard on about uh, James Gunn coming back to Guardians? We did it. Yes. Mm. They reversed the firing, and he's coming back for Guardians 3. Yes. Hell yeah. Ain't no homophobic tweets gonna stop James Gunn. Mm -mm. Was it? Was it homophobic? It was just really bad jokes. I think a couple were homophobic, and maybe a dead baby joke was in there, too. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> I mean... I know. That sucks, but... It's a good thing that they they got it reversed. Yeah, he's coming back, and he, now he's gonna do both the DC movie and a Marvel movie at the same time. Yeah, do you, which one do you think he's gonna put more of his heart into? Oh, Guardians, hundred percent. You think so? Even yeah. after the firing? Yeah, because he's built it like he's kind of brought them from obscurity to a point where. Well, it's like where it's, it's his personality into those movies. Yeah. I would say so. So do you think that the DC was like the or the DC movie that he was going to do like like the ugly like placeholder girlfriend? Yeah, it, it, like it'd be like Rooster. It's the <laughs> son that you that's available <laughs> that you're going to put the effort into, but really you care about Colt. Like Colt is your boy. <laughs> Colt. Is Rooster's your boy. okay. Like Rooster's right here, but Colt's always going to be up here. Did you hear about Rooster coming back possibly after season six? 
Really? Yeah. Huh. Did like his thing come out to not be true, or they just they said move the allegations stuff might there? not might not matter? Apparently, hmm. that's what I heard. Right. I went, oh, we'll see. Yeah. They were saying that there's a possibility he will probably come back. I miss Rooster, but I I don't miss Danny. Danny Masterson. Mm -hmm. Oh, don't don't do the hell do the, the head hell. tilt. Bye. Because it's creepy. <laughs> All right. Um, we got done watching the Umbrella Academy. We did. And uh, what was it? Uh, you enjoyed it, right? Yeah, I liked it a lot. I would say it's uh, I, the way I worded it to Tyler is it's better than Iron Fist. Like it's a. Like, if it was a Marvel thing, it would be better than Luke Cage and Iron Fist. Hmm, yeah. Yeah. Not quite Daredevil or Punisher or Jessica Jones Season 1, but that yeah. mid-tier. So, <clears throat> the question came up, uh, if you were a time traveler assassin, what animal mask would you wear, and what would your code name be? What Golden you... Retriever. A go like a dog, basically? Mm -hmm. And it'd be Lucky. Lucky. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. And uh, discuss. So I think what I said before was I was gonna I might do like a gator and then mm -hmm. call, call my I don't remember call myself Gucci or some kind of handbag thing. But I think I thought I, it was just handbag. I don't remember. Oh. <laughs> but uh, I think w after some deliberation and some thinking about it, I think I will I would go with an axolotl mask and just call myself Ripley right after Ripley. Aw, that's cute. Yeah. Aww. And then murder people with a with a giant machete. Yeah, that'd be creepy. But yeah, so um that's about it. I'm not gonna keep this for too long so that you guys can get to your grandparents or whatever or her grandparents or Yeah, I've got two birthdays to go to. Two birthdays. What'd you get uh what'd you get Jack Jack? A Mario playset. A Mario playset? Yeah, it's like a, it's like the acorn level, and you get to move these pieces around, and there's a warp tube that goes up and down, and a block that pops a coin out. Oh. I You're... didn't check the age on it, now that I think about it, though. You're working on him hard, though. That's what I was suggested. It was either that, Minecraft, or Paw Patrol, and I refused to buy Minecraft stuff. <laughs> Does he play Minecraft? Yeah, he just digs himself in a hole and then digs himself back out. <laughs> He's learning. He is learning. That's better than what I did when I was a kid. Yeah, I'm going to have to teach him how to build a crafting table so he can at least get a pickaxe. Oh, man. All right, so um, you got any last words that you want to say? Red rub. Red. <laughs> oh, yeah. Macho man. All right. Oh, I can't so, get the thing I dropped. Yep. Um. Uh, uh, shout out to your boy Nick, for, and anyone listening to us on any of our social media pr platforms. Uh, thank you. Uh, here's to one year of Skill Monkeys. Yeah. And, uh, it's a good relationship. Hopefully, uh, we can come up with some new stuff this year. Some we'll, bigger. We'll come up with with some stuff. We're going to have a thumb war uh, Big, weekly episode. Yeah. Bigger, better stuff. Uh, hopefully we can get a a group uh, stream again where I'm not vomiting my ass out. Maybe we don't drink. Maybe maybe I don't drink, but you guys can. Yeah. <laughs> but that chicken or dip, at least that needs to be there again. At least uh, no hard liquor for me. Yeah. Just beer. Bears. Yep. All right, man. You have a good time at your uh, your little birthday party. Thank you. You enjoy the rest of your weekend. Yeah. Thank you. And uh, stay nerdy. Stay nerdy. Wu Tang. Hey.